to wrap up the chip <coughs> drum machine gallery, we have the two thrusts, Imbarcat and Stoccata. A lot of this, again, is very similar to what we did for Iron Gate, just with the right foot being the primary mover. So, I guess the Imbarcat shows two things using the true edge and turning the face guard, so kind of this thrace like action, or we can simply strike the hand as we step back. Of course, we try other things, use a true edge defense, use the false edge, that'll all work. These are two that he really shows that are the most useful. So they're coming in, we want to essentially bring our sword over top, thrust to the chest, and get out. Or, as the attack is coming in, we simply step back and throw a mandrito to the hand. And depending on the command, it could be straight or it could be via a stramazzone. Still got to do a few more things we can do here. So we can use false edge, we can void, and we can entrare, or we can use the true edge. So we have false edge cut, traverso, false edge cut, sorry, there's an order, false edge cut, rimabrito, false edge cut, reverso, or false edge bind, thrust in the and leave. We can bring the left leg back, kind of draw them in, throw stramats on into the hand. We can also use entrave, our standard response for any rising thrust, hitting the chest or face, or we can use Mezzo Riverso and thrust as well, so one hand. With dagger in hand, this opens up the outside slip, so really moving us here at all. Essentially just swinging my right foot behind my left as I guide them to my right. Or we can use false edge, trade, and cut to the leg. So we beat and cut the leg as we raise our left hand to cover our head. Against the stoccato, we have mezzo diverso, entrare, and the dagger parry. So mezzo diverso, as per usual, Beat thrust. This could also be a beat and cut to the leg. And drive functions as normal. Jumping up and then leaving. Or we can use the dagger to parry this and strike to the thigh with a reverse. So here comes in, strike low. So it's an outside slip. The attack is distinctly going. To the roll line. Finally, that leaves us with cloak defenses. So we have false edge, true edge, and the outside slip. So same idea here, we're going to beat, start the attack, and have the cloak cover our high outside line. We can use the true edge and go directly to Imbrocato, much safer because this is here, and if they're going more to the right, which they should be, we simply going them out of the way, guide their thrust to our outside, and turn to strike the, the thigh. Finally, against a stoccata, a couple options, we can simply use entrare and get out. We can use the outside slip and hit the arm, because that is available at this point given the trajectory of their attack. So it comes in, hit 
the arm. We can use the mezzo diverso, turn that right into a frustral cut. So one, two, or one, two, and three to get out. And to finish, we can use the false edge and turn that into a ingo cut as well. So we make contact, thrust, and get out. So that will conclude Chingyale. All that's left is the two Alicorno, which are significantly shorter sections, but there's some fun things in there.